uh, hello everyone so we will continue from where we have left in the last video so I said you okay so there's a place where we are you are customizing the speed so this is your serial monitor right this is where your computer is so computer is getting the data from the Arduino and hello Arduino hi so what are the code you are say, say, telling okay hi I am Arduino is going to keep coming here repetitively right very fast way so now the problem is before it comes one thing is you know this Arduino is going to send the data to the computer in this speed 9600 okay so you have to make sure your, your computer also ready to receive the data so you have to do some customization very simple thing here you can see there is a uh, button something drop down that is saying 100 uh, what is the number 115,200 baht so you have to press the drop down menu okay then you will see few values okay so there 9600 is also an available value okay so you have to select that value so you have to get rid of this 115,200 and you have to select 9600 so press the drop down button and select the 9600 because you are the one sending the data from 9600 so your computer also should be able to receive the data in the same speed so you have to press this button and select 9600 and you will get the data properly okay if you can't if you don't want to take it on 9600 and your speed is 1500 and simply what you can do is you can change this also to 1500 okay then you are really good right because why this then you can keep this same value without changing you get it so for the moment we will go for 9600 that's the least value i guess if i am correct and in the serial monitor so if you open the serial monitor you will get that box i showed in this inter what you call interface or google and uh, you can you have to change this to 9600 i hope this is very clear so so you have to sync the computer okay i'm sending the data from 9000 in the 9600 speed so please receive the data in the 9600 speed so this is some some customization you are doing in your computer side because computer is the one going to receive it he is also playing a role okay so that's all you have to do then this thing will come so one thing to tell so since this is repeatedly happening you will see at the initial time t is equal to zero let's say so he is going to display this value okay then he will go to this line come to this line and he's again going to dis print the value okay he's again going to go here come here and he's again going to print it right because void loop is repetitive <coughs> so you will see there's no time delays very fast way this void loop is going to run right so very fast in a very fast speed this value is going to display very fast so sometimes you may not be even able to see this when the new value is popping up okay so very fast so what i will do is i will do like this i will have a delay and let's say uh, 300 milliseconds okay. so now what will happen is Arduino will come and display this value and it will stuck in this delay for 300 milliseconds that's a rule that's a way of delay right delay means the, the program will hold on this place for 300 milliseconds and he'll come here come here and again display this hi i am, I am Arduino value in the computer okay so when he is displaying it the second time 300 milliseconds might have passed already so this displaying or printing in the serial monitor will be little slow so you will notice when the first value is coming first time it is printed and when the second is printing there will be 300 millisecond time delay so then only then you can also notice when the second one is printed okay again 300 third time will be printed after another 300 millisecond so then also you will be able to notice ah now the third is being printed or third value is being displayed okay so you can change the time delay right? you, you understand what i'm telling otherwise it will be very fast it will run like that it will keep running so you cannot see the value is being printed when like that i mean the value hi i'm or, or no hi i'm or you know hi i'm or you know is going to come very fast run. so since you have a delay program will slowly 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 display so you will see ah, okay first time printed second time printed like that i hope this is understandable so for the moment since you are printing same same uh let's say same text sometimes you may want, don't want to get the delay because you know this is what this is the one going to be displayed or this is the one going to be coming from the arduino <laughs> let's say you are going to display a temperature value here you're going to read the temperature sensor and and read the and and send the temperature value through to the computer from the arduino and you want to see when the value is changing so if there is no delay the temperature values are going to be printed forever very fast so you may not be able to see when the value is changing from let's say 20 to 21 you don't know because it's very fast running 
if you have a time delay and you will see okay uh, uh, changing it's changing from 20 to 21 i can notice it like that so i here i hope you can understand that if you don't understand that just remove the delay and run and see what happens if and then add the delay and run and see what will happen you will get the point <coughs> okay so i will write a compile uh, i am sorry i can't upload i mistakenly press that <coughs> i i am supposed to compile this okay i'll write again oh no let's wait because i don't connect a boat so it will not get uploaded it will get an error okay so let's wait for the error now <coughs> okay okay an error occurred while uploading this page don't don't give a damn about it okay so i will write a compile and see uh, whether there is an error or not okay so compiling should be working so see done compiling so that means this is a error free this is totally fine this code okay so go for this code guys so remove this thing upload the code and uh, open the serial monitor and make sure this the current value is the baud rate value is 9600 which value this value okay and see what happens in your serial monitor the value is being printed then add a delay and see so the text or the string or you can say it as a text for the moment text or a sentence or in programming word you can say it as a string okay we will study about the string later and later we will use this word that much very frequently this word will be used when i am uh, teaching you the <coughs> string data types <coughs> okay so try both things and try to customize this text with your name or hi hello world or whatever you want and give a try and let me know guys i will catch you up in the next video guys until then stay safe have a great day here